वेलकम आई विल डिस्कस सर्टेन प्रॉब्लम्स ऑफ गैल्वेनोमीटर एंड सांड इन डिफरेंट केसेस लेट अस सी वन बाय वन द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज अ गैल्वेनोमीटर ऑफ थर्टी ओम रेजिस्टेंस नीडेड अ करंट ऑफ टू मिली एम्पियर फॉर फुल स्केल डिफ्लेक्शन फाइंड द रेजिस्टेंस नीडेड टू कन्वर्ट इट टू अ वोल्ट मीटर ऑफ पॉइंट टू वोल्ट रेंज Suppose this is the galvanometer, and here we are adding a resistance. So what was the original condition? Its resistance is thirty ohm, and the current of two ampere. So B equals to I R. So thirty into Two by thousand, sorry, milli. This much volt, so you can cut it by three by fifty volt. That is equal to zero point zero six volt. This is the relation. Suppose we are giving a name A, B, C. So what we can say that B A minus B C, where this resistance is not there, equals to zero point zero six volt. We want to make it to convert a zero point two volt range. So. B A minus so this is B B minus B C and B A minus B C equals to zero point two volt. So now what we are knowing B A minus B B equal to zero point two minus zero point zero six equals to zero point one four volt. Now. D equals to find the resistance needed. So what we can say, zero point one four equals to. Aye, what is the current? Current is two milliampere. Two by thousand into R. So this one equals to what is coming? One forty equals to two R. So R equals to seventy ohm. In this way, we can calculate the resistance needed. In the so I think it is clear. So we can proceed to the next one. So what is there? A galvanometer of 95 volt, shunted by a 5 volt resistor, gives a deflection of 50 division when joined in series with 20 kilo ohm resistor and a 2 volt accumulator. We have to find the current sensitivity. First, see galvanometer. It is 95 ohm and shunted by 5 ohm, so we can find 1 by R dash equals to 1 by 95 plus 1 by 5 equals to 95 1 plus 90 equals to 20 by 95 4 by 9. So now R equals to finally it is a resistance of twenty <coughs> kilo means twenty thousand plus nineteen by four because it is one by R that is there so it becomes nineteen by four. 
See, <coughs> and the two volt accumulator. So now we have to find I. I equals to B by R. B two by R. That means into four by now current sensitivity it is given fifty division so current sensitivity equals to fifty by this one so fifty division in this much current so fifty by this one so it will be eight into so how much it is coming equals to we can take it nearly it is almost fifty into eight into ten to the power five. By eight, this much. So if we are making it to milli ampere, then fifty into ten to the power five by mu ampere, ten to the power six. Hmm? Just. It will be ten to the power four. So now it will be ten to the power four. So it is fifty by hundred equals to half or equals to zero point five. Now it is mu ampere. Per division, this much. Now we have converted this was in ampere. We have converted it to mu ampere. So now proceed to the third sum. What it is saying that find the value of sine which passes ten percent of the main current through a galvanometer of Resistance ninety nine. Here we are trying to say I through galvanometer equals to I into sound resistance plus galvanometer percent. Since it is saying ten percent, we can say ten, and this I we can put as hundred equals to sound galvanometer resistance is. 99. So 99 plus s. So we are getting it. So what we are getting? 10 by 100 equals to s by 99 plus s or 10s equals to 99 plus s. 10s minus 9s equals to 99, so s equals to 11. No. In this way, in a small trial, we can do this sum. Now the this one, if we want to see, that is a galvanometer of 25 volt connected to a battery of 2 volt along with a resistance in series. When resistance is 3000 ohm. Deflection is 30. Find the resistance in series to reduce this deflection to 20 units. So that means on deflection depends on what? Deflection depends upon current. We can say deflection proportional to current. And what is current? I equals to V by R. In this case, see that. V is constant, so we can say D proportional to 
1 by r or d is inversely proportional to r d for deflection and r is resistance so what we can say d1 by d2 equals to r2 by r1 what was initial deflection deflection of 30 units what we want to convert it to 20 units what was the resistance along with the series so here it is 25 ohm plus one resistance in series when its resistance is 3000 now what we have to this 25 will remain but resistance is unknown we have to find the resistance in series so if we are cutting what we are getting 50 plus 2r equals to 75 plus 9000 that is 2r equals to 9075 minus 50 that is 9025 so from here we can find r equals to 9025. this will be the required resistance in this way if you can see these sums carefully and i will suggest you to do these sums afterwards on your own then you can able to do all problems of galvanometer and sun easily.